I move we deny the reapplications for the four licensees. Tears and hugs from activists as the Liquor Control Commission voted unanimously to shut down the four beer stores in White Clay, Nebraska. I think uh, a dark cloud is lifted uh, over the state of Nebraska today. It's a good day for the Nebraska tribes, a good day for our Lakota neighbors, a good day for Nebraskans. Commissioner cited a woeful lack of adequate law enforcement in the unincorporated village of eight residents. 3.5 million cans of beer are sold here every year, mainly to residents of the nearby Pine Ridge Reservation, where alcohol is banned. This is not a place that we think that can exist as a purveyor of alcohol uh, at all. During a 10-hour hearing two weeks ago, several residents testified about assaults, human trafficking, people passed out, and health sanitation problems. We were appalled at some of the attitudes um, in Sheridan County about we don't have a problem. We found that to be bogus. The liquor stores can remain open on their current licenses until the end of April. Their attorney says they will appeal the decision, saying the condition of adequate law enforcement is only a requirement for new licenses, not renewals. He also reiterated his claim the ruling was politically motivated. Quote, I believe the decision was made a long time ago and it was done because of political pressure. Meanwhile, senators who've been working on a multifaceted plan to address problems in White Clay say this is just a first step. We have work to do. We're not done. This is, this is great. We now need to move forward. Forward on unprecedented ground. In Lincoln, Andrew Ozaki, KETV, Newswatch 7.